everybody and welcome back to my channel. I have no idea why my voice was just that high, but it's okay. Um, so today we're going to be talking about the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Glitter Holiday Collection. I finally bit the bullet and bought some of them. I didn't buy all of them. I just bought the shades I was most interested in. Um, I'm currently wearing Human Nature. Yeah, Human Nature. This is what the packaging looks like in case you haven't seen it. It is glittery, but the glitter does not come off. It has like a sealant over it, which is like a blessing because glitter is awful sometimes when it can come off. It gets everywhere. Um, yeah, but that's the first color. I put it on already. I like it. Actually, I'm just going to show you a comparison between Androgyny and Scorpio with this Human Nature on my hand. First one is Androgyny. In the middle, we have Human Nature, and on the end, we have Scorpio. As you can see, androgyny and human nature are pretty close. I will say this much, human nature is darker. Androgyny is a much lighter color, especially in person, you can tell the difference, I think. But I'd also have to see it when it dries down. It's actually starting to dry down and they're, they're pretty similar, but one is darker. So if you do like that color, you'll probably love human nature. So I'm actually gonna swatch the other ones as well. Overall, I didn't really purchase this collection because some of the colors weren't really my speed. And some of them, there's certain colors that don't really show up well on my skin tone, which it's not the color's fault. It's more of like some things look nude on me and like so nude that it looks like I'm not wearing lipstick. But I also am going to swatch Medusa for you. So this one is a gray color. It is gorgeous. I love it. Yeah, it's like a purpley gray. It is, mm, yeah, this is beautiful. It's very bold. The description says, if you um, are able to rock bold colors, this one is, this one's for you. So that's that one. Then I also have Poinsettia, which I purchased a week or so ago. The Medusa Human Nature and these other two that I have here, I have Mermaid Blood and Berries on Ice. I got in the mail today, but Poinsettia is the one I first purchased because of course it was red. So obviously I was gonna purchase that. And I'll swatch that right there. And this one is a metallic. It is gorgeous. It's red, so obviously I loved it. But yeah, um, it actually has a slightly different feeling formula. I also noticed that with some of the other metallic ones, it's creamier, I would say. It still dries down the same way, doesn't come off. Same great attributes of the other formulas and the other liquid lips by Jeffree Star, but it just feels slightly different going on, but nothing negative about it. All right, let me see what else. Okay, so we've got berries on ice. Let's see what this looks like. I'm probably just gonna keep human nature. I'm not gonna swatch all these on my lips because by the end of that, my lips will be crying. So berries on ice. This is like a purpley color. Oh yeah. Ooh, I'm really curious how close this is to the you Better Work shade from the summer. We're gonna swatch that next to it in a second. Okay. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, that's that's cute. And it and it feels great, just like the other ones. Yeah, the formula's the same. Yeah, that's really pretty. I'm excited about that one. I'd never swatched these two yet. I just opened them. I just ripped the box to pieces just now. Oh, that's good. All right. Oh, come out of the box. Come on now. Okay, this is the one I was really excited about. It's the teal shade. I've never had a teal liquid lip before, but I have one now, so I can cross that off my list. I don't have a list or anything. I was kidding. Um, or was I? Anyway. Yeah, see that? That's going on my face sometime soon. Wow, I sounded like, I'm not even gonna, I really sounded like Fran from, what is the name of that TV show? The Nanny, The Nanny, I think her name was Fran. That's who I just sounded I was like, wow. Anyway, back to the, no, that's not the point. So this is Mermaid Blood. Medusa, poinsettia, and then this last one is berries on ice. I have one more I'm gonna swatch on my hand. I'm gonna swatch human nature, it's on my lips, but so you can get the side by side. And there's human nature. 
I love it. So cute. So, 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 so cute. Okay. I have nothing negative to say about these. Um... Yeah, I like them. I usually typically always like Jeffree Star's liquid lips. They always go on well for me, stay on all day, and have great coverage. But I am going to swatch You Better Work from the Summer Chrome Collection against Berries on Ice, and we'll see what they look like on my other hand. So that's Berries on Ice. I'm just doing like one streak down. And then here's You Better Work. All right, so, so you can see berries on ice is here and you better work is there. They're both a purpley color, but this one's like a deeper, darker one. And this is more bright, similar to comparing human nature and androgyny. Androgyny is a little bit lighter than human nature. So overall, I like the shades. I didn't purchase the whole collection. I probably won't buy all of the shades. Some of them just I wouldn't be interested in purchasing. But if you were wondering about the quality of the colors, they're definitely there. And I will say this much, Jeffree Star Cosmetics liquid lips look the same on every skin tone. I have friends that'll try on my liquid lips that are bright colors and they'll just be as vibrant as they are on them as they are on me, which often you can't find that with liquid lips by brands. You'll often have a liquid lip that you'll try on your friend then try on you and they won't look even remotely the same. I will say though, depending on the skin tone, it does pull out different colors in there. Your different undertones pull out different colors in the liquid lip, which is normal for everything. But overall, I love it and I'm super excited to do some looks with these colors, definitely. And if you are wondering about whether to purchase them, I highly recommend it. So thanks for watching. And if you have any questions, leave a comment down below or DM me. And as always, have a great day.